Hey guys, it's Harley Wood. Um, down here at Deer Camp, I'm actually walking out to one of my stands right now to uh, put some throw and grow out on one of my food plots. And um, wanted to do a real quick video. I am finally able to uh, appendix carry. You can see, got the Glock 30. Um, if you've been watching the channel for a while, you'll know that, um, or you'll be able to tell that I've lost a considerable amount of weight. Uh, I've lost about 46 pounds at this point. And um, before, you know, uh, it was very hard for me to come out here even to deer camp. If you watch my summer um, get home bag test, I came out here for an overnighter and <clears throat> it was only in the 80s, I believe, and I couldn't make it. It was exhausting because I was so out of shape. And I wouldn't say I'm in fantastic cardio shape right now. I mean, I've been walking a little ways. You can probably tell I'm a little winded even now, but I'm not carrying around 255 pounds. I'm carrying around, you know, 205 or 208, something like that. And um, it's a lot easier. It's in the 90s right now, and I'm, I'm cruising, man. So um, lost a bunch of weight because I was just sick of, uh, well, for one, looking like I did. And two, I got a two-year-old trying to keep up with him. Uh, trying to come out here and do this and walk all over the place. It's exhausting. So um, You know the natural question people are gonna ask me. Well, what did you do? Um, no exercise. I basically stopped beer and Soda and a little bit of my portion control Not a whole lot um, You know, maybe instead of when the wife makes tacos instead of having three I might have two but for the most part It was just the beer and the soda man you know, I'd come home at night, my wife's making dinner, and uh, I'd have two or three beers just sitting there watching her make dinner. That's about five, 600 calories right there. And uh, I'd go to lunch and I'd have a Coke at a Mexican restaurant and I'd get it refilled two or three times and that's five, 600 calories, you know, if not more. So that shit adds up, man. So I cut all that out. Pretty much just drink water now. And uh, made a huge difference in about, I don't know, five months, six months, I lost, you know, 50 something pounds. So uh, anyway, that's a long story to get to where I'm, you know, the purpose of this video is I am finally able to appendix carry. I got one of my cameras right here. Um, I'm finally able to appendix carry before I had too much of that tactical tummy going on and uh, it was really uncomfortable. I wouldn't say it's completely comfortable now. I mean, there's, I guess there's a learning curve to it. I've been doing it for a month and um, I'm getting used to it, but I remember back to when I first started carrying it like the four o'clock position, concealed carry. That was a little bit of a pain in the ass at first too. It was uncomfortable. You had to try to figure out, um, you know, how to bend over without, you know, printing on the back too much or your shirt riding up over it. So there's a, you know, this, you gotta figure out when you sit down, how to get your stomach, you know, kind of back behind the pistol and so it doesn't ride up underneath. But uh, so far, I like it. Um, any tips, tricks, post them in the comments below. Um, one thing that I don't like is when I'm riding in the car, or, excuse me, riding in the truck. Sorry, my phone's blowing up. When I'm riding in the truck, the seat belt coming across my, uh, my gun in appendix carry. So I've been taking it out and just putting it under my leg while I'm driving, which is probably better anyway. But any tips, tricks, let me know. Um, so far, I'm liking it. Sorry if this video was a little shaky. I'm out here in the woods. I think I have the uh, stability control on this thing, but yeah. Rocking the appendix carry. Glock 30. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I got a couple videos coming out. I'm down here at camp reviewing a few things. Um, these pants, yeah, another set of tactical pants. Um, a couple other things. So hit that subscribe button if you want to see those videos and uh, we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.